Good morning from St. Louis, Missouri. Bob LaGrasso here from Odds Jam, Odds Jam TV, and the Sports Nuts with my NHL best bets of the day. Yes, I'm a grandpa again. My granddaughter, Alora, was born at 4.30 in the morning, and here she is right here. Just a beautiful baby girl, seven pounds, three ounces, 20 and a half inches long. There's Alora. Alora means divine gift, and she is truly a divine gift. Thank you all for the comments uh, during this time. Uh, as we anticipated her coming into this world, she is a beautiful, healthy baby girl, and I am so excited. Thank you very much. Okay, so on with the business at hand, right? And let me share my screen here. So last night I went three and two. Uh, which capped off a pretty good week. I did not, uh, <laughs> I guess I forgot to, during all the excitement, forgot to give my total odds jam record, but it's in pretty good shape, okay? And uh, we'll probably do that tomorrow. But let's get to the games. First one is Calgary at Colorado. Calgary at Colorado and the Avalanche at home, the best team in the NHL. I don't think that is going to change. I am going to take them on the money line. And I found it at minus 166 on FanDuel. They're a heavy favorite because Calgary played last night. But, you know, that's six. You know what? That really doesn't matter. Okay? Bottom line is Colorado's just the superior team. All right. So our next game as I move along here, is Carolina at Pittsburgh. Now, Carolina played uh, yesterday and, and had a really good game. They're going to Pittsburgh. This is an Eastern Conference matchup. It's a big matchup. And I think that the Penguins are going to win at home. I did not take the puck line. Once again, I took the money line and found the Penguins at minus 130 on Superbook. Sid the Kid and Malkin will get the job done. Okay, our next game is Nashville at Minnesota. Now I've got a little personal thing going on here with this game because I watched the Predators in the Blues play yesterday and I gotta tell you, that was a heck of a game and Nashville is a very talented team and Soros is a heck of a goaltender, even though he gave up five yesterday. I'm going with the Preds on the money line on the road. They're the dog. And you know what? The dog is plus 150 on Superbook. Let's take it. And now we go back to my St. Louis Blues. But before that, one more picture of Alora there. Hi, Alora. There's your Blues. She's going to be a St. Louis Blues fan. I can tell you that right now. I'm going to tell you that right now. She will be going, let's go, Blues. Blues at home after beating Nashville yesterday. They've had a couple of players out. Uh, they actually played a game with seven defensemen uh, the other day. Uh, their fourth line was outstanding uh, yesterday. I am going to go with the Blues on this if I can get my act together here. I'm going to go with the Blues on the money line. They are at home. They are, are great at home. And I found them at minus 135 on Superbook. Okay. In my final game of the day, and one more time, there's Alora. There she is. Got you, beautiful. Final game of the day is Toronto at Buffalo. Now... This is just going to match up with a total goals game. It just has the over all, it just all over the over, <laughs> if you know what I mean. I can go over six. I can go over six and a half. I'm going to go over six and a half. And I found that at minus 104 
on FanDuel. Hey, you know what, folks? I hope that you have a great, great day. I hope that you have enjoyed what I've brought to you. It means a lot that you welcomed this little girl into the world with me. Thank you so much. Heartfelt. It really is heartfelt. And the only thing I could tell you is, for me and Alora, as we leave this right now, for me and Alora, peace.